I'm Cynthia Knight, the director of the Barron Arts Center, and I am pleased to invite you all to come to our new exhibit here at the Barron Arts Center, Frontline Arts. Frontline Arts began in New Jersey in 2011 and was known as Combat Paper New Jersey. Combat Paper is made from U.S. military uniforms, and that in itself, for those of us who are veterans, carries a tremendous emotional impact. And we've found doing that, that it also uh, is felt by people in the civilian community as well, because people have connections. The first time I held that paper in my hands, I immediately grasped the emotional intensity. A combat paper is not just one thing. And we've made commonly desert tan camouflage tan paper, green paper from uh, Vietnam era woodland camouflage, we made white combat paper from uh, Navy officers dressed white uniforms. We made blue combat paper from the operating room scrubs worn by a woman veteran, U.S. Army veteran, who worked uh, operating rooms in Mogadishu, Somalia during uh, the Black Hawk Down days. So combat paper can look a lot of different ways, and, and it tells a lot of different stories. We've been lucky to, to be noticed, first of all, by a lot of really cool art venues. They, they got it when they saw what we were doing. And as anybody who's ever made art can tell you, it's all well and good to draw your pictures or write your stories or whatever your art is, but there has to be someone on the receiving end. And so we're very grateful to be here and we hope that people come out and see it. Establish a dialogue find that we open a door to communication because many, many, many in America, whether they know it or not, they have the stories inside of them too. And uh, we're here to tell ours and to listen to yours.